Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars and I'm here today for you with the third in a series of videos on the topic the spiritual powers of omniscience, omnipresence, and omnipotence on earth today. Things to look out for by Alice B. Claggett. This, the third in the series, is entitled Accumulation of Students Samskaras in the Dark Body of a spiritual teacher who is omniscient, omnipresent, and omnipotent. And it goes like this. In a spiritual teacher who is omnipresent, omniscient, and omnipotent, when his body of light reaches out to his spiritual students, I feel they attain the experience of omnipresence, omniscience and omnipotence as well. However, and in addition, the soul wounding in his dark body mixes with theirs. Gradually, over time, because of this mixing of the spiritual teacher's dark body with those of his followers, he picks up and mixes with his own samskaras the samskaras of all his followers. Thus, with time, he becomes, as it were, a compendium or encyclopedia of soul-wounded qualities. At that point where he has many followers, his soul wounding becomes very profound, and he passes his soul wounding on to new members of his group along with the ecstatic experiences of omniscience, omnipresence, and omnipotence. It's so funny, I'm hearing, first I heard the low growl of a high-flying airplane, and now I hear the racket of a, of a helicopter going overhead, and it always seems to me that I hear the omniscient, omnipresent, omnipotent set of, of people growling in that way from way high up overhead uh, when I discuss this, this topic and, and this, this time is no exception. Um, it's, it's, you know, a person who's involved in conspiracy theory would say, oh my gosh, they, can, they control all the airplanes or something like that. They can play, control all the dark, dense sounds in the world and they're, they're because they're all powerful, they can do bad things to me, but I don't think of it like that. I think of it as a display from God. I think God is, is explaining to me that these powers exist in the world and that I must be peaceful and, and of neutral mind and uh, full of joy and love and light, even though there are these dense, very dense and very sublime energies to be found here on earth. That's what I feel. That sound is a test of faith every time I discuss this topic. Well, dear ones, be safe, be full of joy in these troubled times, and I'll talk to you again soon.